Lightning storms come and go across much of the globe, but in this rural fishing village, they are so common that they've been given a name. The phenomenon is called the Relampago de Catatumbo, or Catatumbo lightning. It appears more than 160 nights a year over Congo Mirador in Venezuela. It sometimes lasts up to nine hours. Edine Hernandez has lived here for more than 60 years. He poetically describes how the lightning begins after sunset. Air Force meteorologist Ramon Velasquez says the Catatumbo is unlike other lightning storms. Here, 90 percent of the strikes move from cloud to cloud rather than cloud to ground. The bolts appear up to 40 times in one minute. Scientists have not reached a consensus on what causes the Catatumbo, but several theories have emerged. High levels of methane gas in the area may contribute, or it may be winds that blow from the Andes and across vast marshlands. But the beauty of the light shows has not improved life for the poor families who live here. They often cram eight people into one-room homes. Locals complain the federal government hasn't done enough to promote tourism. This tourism official calls the Catatumbo a treasure that can lift all of those who live in Congo Mirador. Environmentalists are asking the United Nations to make the region a national heritage site. They say the recognition could help preserve the ecosystem. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.